Hi, Christian here and owner of Tinsley Transfers. I'm going to show you how to apply and get the best results with this 3D FX transfer. Now the 3D FX transfer was developed to give a unique and simple application, but with professional results. And to do this, all you're going to need is water and scissors. First, carefully cut open the package. Remove the blister, open the back, and take out the card. Next, peel the plastic off of the adhesive paper. Now, grab the plastic by the corners, line it up to your paper, and gently roll down the plastic so that your appliance is face down on the adhesive paper. Rub outwards towards the edge of the paper, pressing firmly and removing any trapped air. Next, you want to cut around the piece, being careful not to cut into the edge of your transfer. Here's a tip. Hold your piece up to the light and take a permanent marker or pencil, making the shape of the wound or scar. This will help you be more precise with the placement of your transfer. Before applying, make sure the skin is clean, free of any dirt, oils, makeup, or hair. When ready to apply, peel off the plastic, exposing the sticky underside. When you've decided where to apply the transfer, press it firmly into the skin. Once your transfer is secure, get your sponge and wet the adhesive paper. It is very important the paper is fully saturated, so please don't rush. When you are ready to remove the adhesive paper, give it one last push into the skin and then slowly peel the paper away. After you peel the paper away, you may find an air bubble or lifted edge. Simply wet your finger with water and press the transfer back into the skin. Once you're done with the application, you can add blood FX or makeup to complete the character. That's it. Be creative and explore the imagination. Now remember to look at the back of the package for directions on how to remove your 3D FX transfer. We'd also love if you would share your photos with us, so please follow us at Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, or visit us at tinsleytransfers.com.